Well, hello there, friends. Dylan in the details here to get down to the brass tacks with you, of course. And look here, our verse our gift from Capcom, the 25th anniversary, of course. Yes, here it is. Searching for opponents, searching for opponents. Guess what this is? This is Fortnite. This is your gift, real Resident Evil fans, didn't you know? Anyway, my friends, I wanted to give you this example of what this game is going to be like and what to expect from Capcom for years to come. Since Resident Evil has become an annual release from Capcom, I figure this is pretty much the template for what we can expect down the road as long as they keep producing Resident Evil games anyway. I mean, I expect from now on every single installment of Resident Evil to have some kind of multiplayer facet, some attachment to it that is just kind of foreign and doesn't make a whole lot of sense. but. Nonetheless, I, I expect that for years to come, perhaps every single Resident Evil, and perhaps even some standalone ones. Of course, we haven't received the Outbreak that everyone's really been wanting this entire time. Outbreak was a classic Resident Evil game, and I barely got to play it online. But that didn't matter, because I got to play it offline. There was an offline mode, and the AI actually worked. So, Capcom, what's going on here? Why are you having such a hard time producing actual content where you have to actually put your foot down and work and demand work of the lazy millennial developers you employ because frankly this is getting sad and the sadder I get the more fucking pissed off I get but regardless folks I didn't want to interrupt too much I'm gonna give you a raw example here of the gameplay to expect throughout this uh, Fortnite edition of Resident Evil. I'll be back with you in a second, folks, to give you that much-needed reality check, but for now I wanted to give you some raw gameplay, so here you go.
Wow. Well, if that uh, wasn't a game, I tell you, I, I don't know what was. Anyway, I really didn't hate that. But I tell you what I hate is that Capcom has decided this is the path of Resident Evil. This, this game requires you to know the dodging mechanic and to utilize it constantly. That's how you survive. That's how you make progress. This is going to be one of the most annoying, useless-ass, ugly games ever created by Capcom. I swear. This is... Th this is... Uh, I, I, I don't know what this is. But I know that's a terrible iteration of Jill Valentine right there. And God Almighty, who is that? Who is that? That's... That's... I don't know who that is. That's a stranger. I don't know who that is. Anyway, I just wanted to tell you guys, although I didn't entirely hate that, it is still a spit in the face of all of us real Resident Evil fans. I'm not trying to engage in Fortnite here with the dumb babies, but I guess that's what they want for the series. And if that's where it's going, I, I, I don't know if I want to be aboard that boat, because frankly, as an ambassador of Resident Evil and Capcom, I am really just incredibly saddened that this is what they chose to do for the 25th anniversary that was supposed to be for the fans. They could have done anything, but this is what they've done. What they've done. What they've done. What they've done. What they've done.